Hi everyone, it's Heather. Welcome back into the Paper Castle. I have a quick sales update for you guys. Um, I've had a really good couple of days on eBay. Uh, and i got to make this quick because my daughter's about to come home from school. So I'm going to show you everything that's sold or that currently has bids before I get this stuff that's sold and paid for shipped out. So first up is this 60 Christmas Carols for Kids 3 CD set. I bought this at a rummage sale a couple weeks ago for a dollar. Uh, just sold it for $12.99. All of these, by the way, I believe have free shipping. Um, and everything, I think, is actually going to either Virginia, North Carolina, Pennsylvania, or New York, so I don't have to pay a lot for shipping, which is fantastic. All right, a couple of these things are wrapped up, so I apologize. Um, this, I know it's hard to see, but there's a hat, and it's a snowman, and he's standing on top of a little box. I'll try and remember to put pictures at the end so you can see what these look like. But this is a Nicole Sayer um, piece. She did these for Midwest of Cannon Falls. And I got this little guy for a dollar, uh, and he's actually missing an ornament that he should be holding in his hand. Uh, but I still got $24.99, and he'll be shipped out first class mail. Then this is also wrapped up, and it's hard to see, but this is a Radica You Create Music. Uh, it's like a sound mixer for kids. And this I also got for a dollar at a rummage sale. Sold this for $24.99. And this will go in a flat rate padded envelope. Then the last thing that's wrapped up, I promise, <laughs> is this. This is a little ramekin. It's a red ramekin, and the lid is upside down, um, but it has a rooster on top. This is from Martha Stewart. I got this at a rummage sale back in the spring for $0.25, cents, and this sold for $15.99. And... I think that's going to go priority, but it should only cost me like five or six dollars. So now I'm going to show you guys the stuff that's not all wrapped up. Um, these are things that currently have bids. I got these three little Wilton Armitol candlesticks for 50 cents at a rummage sale a couple weeks ago and have an initial bid on these of uh, $29.99 with free first class shipping because these are really, really lightweight. It'll hardly cost anything to ship those. At that same sale, I also picked up this Alaska Classics Christmas Ornament by C. Allen Johnson. This is from 1987, I believe. And I paid $0.10 cents for this, and it has a bid right now of $17.99. That'll also go first class. Then I got these two Baby Babble. DVDs from uh, the Family Success Center. It's a place that we have here in town. They have a little thrift store in their basement. I think I paid two for these total. And right now the bid is at $22.99 and these will also go first class. And now these are things that have sold and are being shipped out except for one which I'm waiting for payment on. But I have seven of these angels. I have three of these and then four of these, they don't all look like this. They're kind of all mixed, but they're all, you know, spun or blown glass little angels. These belong to my husband's aunt who passed away a couple years ago, and I listed a bunch of her things. This is one of the last lots to go. I actually had these in two separate auctions. I had the three angels, or three buy it now, sorry. The three angels, and then I had the other four in a different lot. And these both sold, I think the total was... $22.99 or $24.99 and they're being shipped out together so I only have to pay once and these should also be able to go out first class because they're really lightweight and some of them are even broken I don't think this one is but a couple of these at least one of these is broken in spots but they still buy them that always amazes me okay moving on um, I bought this at a flea market the other, or not a flea market, a garage sale the other week for $5. Just sold this for $29.99 with free priority shipping, but it's going to North Carolina, so it should only cost me about $6, maybe $7. Then this game called Terrace, this is brand new and sealed. I got this at a, a sale back in the spring, a rummage sale for a dollar. This sold for $39.99, and this is only going to Pennsylvania, I believe. 
so that'll be um, minimal shipping. Then I sold two sweaters that I got at a rummage sale a couple weeks ago. Paid a dollar for each of them. Uh, this one I bought because it said Winfjord Pure New Wool and then it said it was made in Norway. So I took a chance on it and this sold for $39.99 with free shipping. And this I believe is going to Virginia. So it's minimal shipping on that also. And also going to Virginia is this lovely thing. <laughs> this is a vintage you guys can see this. Hold on. This is a vintage spider. Let me get the tag. This is a vintage spider jacket or windbreaker. Um, it's called the windstopper. Um, the bottom is knit, the top is like a nylon paid a dollar for this and this sold for, um, it's got more than one bid, went up to $51 with free priority shipping, like I said, also going to Virginia. And then last but not least, my home run of the lot was um, something that sold this morning. This is Lennox. Um, these two figurines are in the Mistletoe Park series. You guys got to keep an eye out for this because this is amazing. Sells really, really well. I had no idea until I looked this up on my phone. But I paid $5 for this at a rummage sale, the same one where I bought that um, C CD of Christmas carols. And paid $5 and just sold it today for a buy it now of $150 with free shipping. And this is only going to Pennsylvania. So not too shabby and I just also sold a bottle of hand lotion that I bought for like a dollar that I haven't even gotten in into my room to get yet for I think 17 and that can go in a padded flat rate envelope so like I said the past two days have been pretty good um, just waiting for somebody to pay me for this spider windbreaker and we'll be good so thanks for watching everyone um, sorry if this sounded rushed but you know I wanted to get this done before she got home actually she did just get home but I think she realized what I was doing and went upstairs to her room so thanks for watching and I'll talk to you soon Bye.